The physically challenged children living at the Cheshire Home Hostel attended school at the nearby Mulumba Primary and Kizito College Senior Secondary Schools, although there are no special teachers to care for their needs, with some already graduated from UNAM and the Polytechnic of Namibia. The centre further has outreach programs together with the health ministry to visit primary schools and clinics in the area with the aim to raise awareness and to identify children living with disabilities. Once identified, home visits to those children and their families are undertaken to improve the living conditions of the child by referring them to the available services as well as educating the parents on how to take care of the child's needs. Nube noted that a community cannot be equitable unless all children are included and children with disabilities cannot be included until sound data collection and analysis render them visible. We need to address the invisibility of children with disabilities. It is important to collect data about where they live, what barriers they face and what support they need. The governor of the Zambezi region, Alufia Sampofu, encouraged love, respect and discipline among the children living with disabilities if they want to be a success in life. We call upon the parents and guidance in Zambezi region not to hide the children who are physically challenged. Please bring them up. There are so many places where you can take these children. One of them is Cheshire Home, so that they come and learn, they come and study, and also build their future. We always know that patience and dedication will always pay at the end of the day. He noted that disability is not an inability and that they need to work extra hard to realize their goals in life with the opportunities they are given by the Cheshire Home to have a roof over their heads and to attend school while also enjoying special training at the center.